Make yourself unstoppable. It is one of the best things that you can do for yourself to work on the ability to become unstoppable. Think about that for a moment. Think about what that means. If you're trying to do something and you are unstoppable, you're probably going to get it done. I mean, who wouldn't want that superpower to become unstoppable? I made a short video talking about mathematics and how mathematics helps build the traits you need to become unstoppable. Every time you do a math problem, you have to think. So you're training your mind. But it's more than that. It's the effort you put in to do that problem that builds grit. And you can take that grit and you can apply it to other areas of your life. So if you're watching this video and you do mathematics, you already are working towards becoming unstoppable. You're, 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 you're getting there. Or you might already be there. I don't know, right? You might be there. In this video, I'm going to give you a strategy that you can use to become unstoppable at anything. Well, not anything. That's the first step, is define your thing that you want to become unstoppable at. You see, it's hard to be unstoppable at something you don't want. You have to want it. So the first thing you need to do is you need to think about what it is you really want. Like, what do you really want? And I mean really want. And it needs to be something big, something that you might think is not realistic. So, so maybe you already have goals, that's fine, but I want you to think bigger, okay? I want you to think beyond your current goals. I've had thousands of students over the years, and a lot of times they'll, they'll tell me their major, and oftentimes I would come back with, like, oh, hey, well, why don't you do this, or have you considered this? I would just kind of like gently throw out a, another option that was a little bit better than what they were aiming for, and they're like, oh, you think I could do that? A lot of times they doubted themselves, like they, like they didn't have the ability. So w I want you to think bigger than your goals. Pretend that you do have the ability. Pretend that you would succeed as long as you put in the work. So what would you do with your life if you knew you could not fail, and all you had to do was put in the work? What would you do? That needs to be your goal, because that's big, and that's amazing. And that's life-changing. And you know you want that. And that's something you can work hard towards. And you can slowly develop the quality of becoming unstoppable towards that thing. But you have to want it, right? You have to want it. I mean, I like old cars. I once bought an old car because I thought, oh, this is a really cool car. Maybe I can work on this car and be like a mechanic. And I saw it on the side of the road. It was really cheap. So I bought the car. I worked on it once for like half an hour. I cut my knuckles. I quit because I didn't really want it. It was just a, it was just a fantasy. I didn't want to really be a mechanic and work with my hands. I wasn't very good at it. I always cut my hands, got oil on my fingernails. Some people, yes, just not for me. So the point is, it has to be something you really want, right? You really, really want to do or be. And it could be anything, any life you want. Pretend you could have it. That's your goal. That's your goal. Once you have your goal, then when you start working towards that goal, you're going to find something interesting happens. You're going to have lots of steps to do, right? It's going to take a lot of work. And every time you fail, and you get back up again, and you try again, you're building grit. It's like, it's like doing those hard math problems, it's the same thing. And the reason you're gonna get back up again and keep trying, the reason you're gonna start becoming unstoppable is because this is a big goal, right? You can't just become unstoppable at anything. No, no, it doesn't work that way. It has to be something you really want, okay? And that's how you can start to become unstoppable. 
So when you fail, you get back up and you try again. The most important step though is to actually start, right? To start, to actually do it. You know, it's easy to sit here and think about what you wanna do. It's good to think about your dreams like we just did a minute ago. But thinking about your dreams is not going to, you know, make them magically happen. The only thing that's gonna get you there is action. Right? Take action. Action is the key to everything. So when you're working on this unstoppable thing, or this thing you want to become unstoppable at, rather, and you feel like quitting, think of your big goal, right? Think of your big goal. It'll keep you going when you don't feel like working anymore. More importantly than anything though, you have to believe. You have to believe that you can do it. And I think that's something that a lot of people don't have. Especially if you go back to the beginning when we were talking about your goal. Maybe you don't believe that you can accomplish your goal. Maybe there's something you want, but you don't think you can get it. You have to believe, right? If you don't believe in yourself, if you don't believe in your ability to do something, then, I mean, you have to. But again, you have to want it too, right? That's the thing. It's like me and the car story, right? <laughs> I, oh, it'd be really fun to work on old cars and fix them up. And No, no. Mm -mm, not for me. Right, not for me. <laughs> not for me. No, sir. So find something you really want to do with your life and believe you can do it and start doing it. Take action. Get to work. You know, having that big dream, because it's so big, It'll help you create a sense of urgency, which, which you want to develop as well. It's not just about becoming unstoppable. You have to have a sense of urgency. You know, most people go through life and they don't know what they want to do with their lives. That, that's normal, right? That's normal. That's normal. So yeah. Anyways, I uh, wanted to make this video to follow up because I made a short video on becoming unstoppable and I thought, let me, let me just talk about it some more. So work on becoming unstoppable. You can do it. You can do it. If you, if you have a good enough reason and you want something and you really want something, then you will work towards it, my friend, and you will have that sense of urgency and you will just keep pushing. But you have to find something you really want, right? And I think the problem, I think the problem is sometimes people think they want, they, they want something, right? And Society just doesn't, you know, if, if, you, if you tell people your big dreams, a lot of times what happens is they react in a way, they react, they react in the only way they know. I'm not saying they're bad, they're just people. So if I tell someone, oh yeah, you know, I'm gonna you know, you know, do something crazy, they look at you like, what? You know, like a concrete example would be, um, you know, a student, uh, who is, you know, failing a class, telling his parents that he wants to be a doctor, you know. His parents might say, well, you're not even passing your class. That's ridiculous, you know, so stuff like that, you know. Or, you know, you tell someone you have these big goals and you want to be like the best in the world at, you know, powerlifting or something. People will look at you like, well, you want to be a championship powerlifter? What are the chances of that? So people always tend to react in a way perhaps that is not, good for your mentality. So my advice is keep your big goals to yourself. And if you're gonna share your big goals, maybe only share them with people you really, really trust. And, and even then, you know, ideally it's people who also have really big goals and have the same line of thinking as you do. Because not everyone believes this, right? Not everyone believes that you can do anything, right? People say, oh no, no, it's garbage. No, you can do anything. Okay, you can. You can, you can definitely do it. So believe in yourself, watch out who you tell, find your big dream, grind. When you fail, you get back up again, create that sense of urgency, make yourself unstoppable. Now go get it.